Day two at Indo-Pacific Conference has been fantastic. Our stand has been super busy the whole day. A lot of engagement with Navy, a lot of engagement with Army, and a lot of engagement with the rest of Defence Industry and Supplies. This is the main spot where you can actually speak to the Navy, get their opinions and see what they actually want. You're in a unique position where you can talk to the end user one-on-one -on -one, and you can actually talk to them about the challenges they face, what they want to see on our ship and how we can continuously improve the best we can. I've heard from a couple people that this is the busiest conference they've ever been to. We're right on the edge of innovation in so many different areas. Today we are here to acknowledge research and development collaborations between Navantia Australia and academic institutions. Innovation has been always at the heart of Navantia across its long history. RMIT looks forward to a long and productive cooperation with Navantia. We look forward to deepening that collaboration and delivering to the needs of the Navy and Defence into the future. I'm delighted to be here to witness to the progression of this important collaboration between our company and UTS. That creates a fantastic ecosystem of Australian universities, world-class company in Navantia and Navantia Australia and its sovereign capability. Not only do we build really awesome new ships, but we're trying to introduce new technologies into everything that we do. This year we have an innovation space and people are walking out really, really impressed. If you're here at Indopac this year, get around to the Navantia Australia stand.